Hello everyone, this is Sangha Mukherjee. Welcome to the course of Karukan Defense. In this lecture, I am going to discuss one of the most important variations in Karukan Defense and that is the Sim Slope Variation. So, let's see how the variation continues. White start with the move e4 and after black responded with c6, we have d4, d5, and knight to c3, d takes on e4, knight takes on e4, and now not bishop to f5, which is the classical variation in Karokan defense, but in this position, black responded with knight to d7. This variation is named after the former world champion Vasily Simsrov, who introduced it in the late 1950s. It is one of the most important variation in Karokan defense. Now, what is the basic idea behind knight to d7? The idea is very simple. Black wants to develop his king's knight but without incurring the pawn weakness as he does in classical variation where he plays an immediate knight to f6. Black's basic plan is to develop his pieces and then to counter in the center with c5. After exchanging the c pawn with the d pawn, black should be left with central pawn majority which may prove to be an advantage in long run. Now what does white play? There are three main lines that white can play in this position. The most solid one is to play knight to f3. White usually develops in hopes to obtain a small advantage to take into middle game. Second variation based on bishop to c4. This is more aggressive and there are many more danger for black in the early stage of the game. And the third line is knight to g5. This is relatively a new and dangerous system that developed because of the problems white was having in the other lines. This is now considered as the main line. There are a couple of other alternative moves also played in this position that is bishop to d3. Then black will play probably knight from g to f6 and then knight to g5 but it is not played so often anymore. The other move of a quick mention is queen to e2. This is occasionally played because white is hoping that black would not notice that if in this position knight to f6 is played then simply knight to d6 is made. But here black will play e6 or knight from d to f6. So these all are the lines that are derived from sim slope variation. So in this video I only discuss the basic intro of this variation and also why knight to d7 is played and what should white and black play in their fifth move. In my next video I will discuss this variation in details one by one. So see you in my next video. Thank you.